So after solving this determinant, we got value as 1 by 4. Now similarly, I'll find the value of the second Jacobians and after that we'll substitute the both values in equation number 1. So I'm making this as equation number 2. So therefore, Jacobian of u v w with respect to r theta and phi is given by a determinant that is now let's find the value of all these terms so to find the values first of all i'll consider the values of u v and w which is given in the problem so in the problem u is given as r sin theta into cos phi v is given as r sin theta sin phi and w is given as r of cos theta so let's start with the calculations so after differentiating u with respect to r theta phi and similarly differentiating v and w with respect to r theta and phi we will get the following values So, these are the values of these 9 terms. Now, let's find the value of determinants. So, therefore, it is sin theta cos phi into determinant of this 2 by 2 matrix. So, this is 0. This multiplication will be plus r square sin square theta into cos phi next this term that is minus r cos theta cos phi into this will be 0 again this is minus r sin theta cos theta cos phi and the last term is minus r sin theta sin phi into multiplication of this that is minus r sin square theta sin phi and this minus r cos square theta sin phi. So the next step is if I multiply the bracket with this term we will get r square next sin will become sin cube theta and this is cos square phi. Similarly, here we will get minus minus plus r square, this will become sin theta as it is and cos square theta and cos square phi. Next, here we will get minus minus plus r square sin cube theta and sin square phi. Next, this will become minus minus plus r square sin theta as it is cos square theta and sin square phi. So, after solving this, if you will observe that in these two terms, we have r square sin theta and cos square theta. So, I am taking it outside and inside bracket from here cos square phi will remain and from here sin square phi will remain. Similarly, if you will observe these two terms then here r square is common. Similarly, sin cube theta is common. So, we will get r square sin cube theta and inside bracket from here cos square phi will remain and from here sin square phi will remain. So this is equal to 1 and this is also equal to 1. So we will get r square sin cube theta from the first term and r square sin theta cos square theta from the second term. So therefore 
that is equal to that is do of u v w by do of r theta phi is equal to r square sin cube theta from the first term plus r square sin theta into cos square theta. Now next here r square is again common and sin theta is common. So inside bracket from the first term sin square theta will remain and from the second term cos square theta will remain which is again equal to 1. So we will get r square sin theta and this is my equation number 3. So now let us substitute equation number 2 and 3 in equation number 1. So from 1, 2 and 3 we will get do of x, y, z with respect to r theta phi is nothing but 1 upon 4 that is value of first Jacobian and r square sin theta that is value of second Jacobian and this is the final answer. Thank you.